Hey lovely people and welcome back to another video here on this channel. So today is going to be a super fun one. I'm going to be getting into the Christmassy spirit and transforming our autumnal home into a Christmassy one. And I thought I would take you along with. Now I do have a couple of little small crafts that I'll be doing in this video as well. So stay tuned for those. One of them is a really good no so project and actually perfect for children doesn't take too long and that is a lovely felt advent calendar which i will display here so i'm going to light a candle get into the christmasy spirit i need to sort out the decorations on the fireplace and little bits and bobs like that so yeah hope you enjoy let's get straight on in oh and if i sound nasal it's because i've just got over a cold so please excuse that but let's get on into the video. So I'm going to get started, or rather complete, this advent calendar. Now this is an absolutely perfect craft to be doing with children, but to be honest anyone can do this. There's no sewing necessary, you can sew it if you want, but I've hot glue gunned most of this. So it's really easy for anyone of any age to do this, and I think it's really simple, really effective, really beautiful. Obviously we're going to have chocolate advent calendars this year, but this one is going to be slightly different. The aim with this one is we're going to put lovely experiences that we can do together as a couple in each of these doors. And they can be something really simple like having a hot chocolate on a walk, or doing something like visiting some of the Christmassy lights somewhere. So there's going to be different things to do every day. Now let me show you what it looks like so far because I really love how this has turned out. Here, I have to be careful with how I hold it because it's not secured yet. I might have to show you down here actually, <laughs> one second. So this is the advent calendar so far. These are not completely stuck down yet. A lot of them are pinned, but everything's been cut out, folded and arranged and measured. And I've got this really lovely felt fabric. I actually picked up from north of Italy last year at Christmas time and I thought I would put it to good use for this and I just love the colour schemes on this and if you look really closely you just have very subtle Christmassy things you've got these wintry helicopter plants don't you remember these when you were children but they're really fun um snowflakes you've got gingerbread men you've got sweets you've got candy so yeah really lovely theme really lovely colours and I've hand cut out these numbers, but again, if you're using a less busy felt than this, you could probably write on the numbers or get some stickers or things like that. So depends what you want to do really. But I thought because it's quite a busy print, I wanted to do some block numbers. So that it's easy to kind of see. So yeah, that was the aim with that. Got a little heart in the middle for number 25. And yeah, I think it just looks really, really good. Down in the description box, I will leave the measurements that I've done here to make the little doors and the general size and things as well. So if you want to do the similar sort of situation, you can do. The aim with this is to kind of roll this, um, put like a little stick through it, and sort of hang it that way. But yeah, you can do it any way you want really, but really love how this turned out. You're gonna have to excuse the fact that I can't actually talk at the moment because I actually can't breathe. But, but yeah, really excited to get this done because it's, end of November now so we need to get this ready. I've already printed out the little, let me show you. Yes, yeah, so I've already pre-populated, so we actually sat down together um, to figure these out, but um, we've got these little strips that we um, wrote and typed up, cut out, printed out, and they're just little things like walk um, with a flask of hot chocolate, 
stargazing in the car because I've got a little panoramic roof which is just lovely so just little things like that that we can fold and pop into each of the doors um, we have kind of arranged roughly what days they're going to be on in order for it to just kind of work but if we open one and it needs to be done on a weekend for example we'll just swap it around but yeah really love that idea because it's just a little bit more thoughtful but definitely you could pop individual chocolates candy you could pop in little toys just depending on who it's for and yeah i think it's just a really lovely idea so all the numbers have been stuck on i'm going to now hot glue down all the individual doors measure them out and things and then i will join you back and show you the progress update It looks so cute. Let me show you. So this is the finished advent calendar. How adorable. So it looks so much better now. It's all stuck on because with all the clips you just couldn't see what it was going to look like. But the top has been folded over so I can put a little button or string through there to hang it up. And then if you look a bit closer you have all the individual little pockets that have the little... Um, messages and things in them which I think is really really adorable and I just really love the finish on this I think it just looks so nice um really festive with festive colors but not too tacky Christmassy it's not tacky Christmassy I feel like it's really nice and sophisticated Christmassy so yeah definitely one that I'd recommend for you guys to try at home um it didn't take me long at all and yeah really really effective thing to keep bringing out every single year and yeah, just something that will pass down the generations, I'm sure. So, yeah, really love it. So guys, I would really love to know if you have also put up your Christmas decorations already too, and any homemade Christmassy bits that you've made throughout the years that you bring out every single year. I would love to know what they are. So let me know in the comments down below your special Christmas makes. So guys, I really hope you enjoyed watching this video, and I will see you in my next one. Bye.